Good morning, good morning. How are you today? I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. And how are you? My name is Miss Janet. And if today is your first time here, can I get a woohoo? Woohoo! Yes. <laughs> how are you? How do you feel? Oh. Thank you for sharing all this with me, but I am feeling so happy and I am ready to learn and have fun with you. Do you hear that? What can that be? It's the sound of the learning bell. And we have to do three things. One, let's make sure that we have our looking eyes wide open. Check, check, two. Let's make sure that our listening ears are wide open. Three, let's put on our thinking caps. And I am getting mine. Can you grab your thinking cap and let's lift it up together and put it on. Check. Yes, we are ready now. Now, let's get to know what day is today by singing the Days of the Week song. There are seven days in a week. Seven fingers up. Yes, thank you for showing me your seven fingers. There are seven days in a week and they are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in a week. Yes, there are seven days in a week. And what day is today? If yesterday was Wednesday, today will be Thursday. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday. All day long, uh, all day long. Uh, Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. All day long, uh, all day long. Uh. Yes, great singing. Today is Thursday, and Thursday starts with the letter T. And T makes the sound T. T, -t, -t. t is for tiger. T is for tree. Now, let's identify all the letters in Thursday by spelling it. And are you ready to do that with me? Great. Thursday. T H U R S D a Y spells Thursday. Yes, if today is Thursday, tomorrow will be Friday. All right, let's move on to the month of the year. What month are we in? We are in the month of August, and August is the eighth month of the year. The year is 2021 or oh, 2021. What is the letter of the week? The letter of the week is S. And S make the sound S. S is for seahorse. S is for seal. And this is the uppercase S. And this is the lowercase S. What is the color of the week? The color of the week is brown. And let's spell brown. Brown. B R O W N. Spells brown. Can you look around where you are to find something brown? Yay! Great. Let's start. Brown. Where are you? Where are you? What did you find? Oh, thank you for sharing that with me. But I found my paintbrush and I found my brown color pencil. Great job. Let's move on to the shape of the week. And the shape of the week is a star. Can we sing the Twinkle Twinkle Little Star song? 
One, two, three. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high. Like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. How I wonder what you are. Ah, uh, great singing, great. Yes, the ship of the week is a star, and star has five points. Let's count them. Are you ready to count it together? Yeah. Great, let's start. One, two, three, four, and five. Great. What is the number of the week? The number of the week is ten, and ten has one and zero standing together when one and zero stand together it is called 10 and today do you know what we are going to do we are going to count 10 down to one by clapping our hands and this is how it will go 10 9 8 do you get that are you ready to do it together one two three 10 9 8 7 Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great counting. Oh, we are done revealing our entire learning board. And you know what we are doing today on our special lesson? On Thursdays, we either draw the shape of the week or we practice writing or tracing the letter of the week. And today, we are going to write or trace the letter of the week so can you get something that you trace on and something that you trace with and i am going to use my blue marker and the letter of the week is s we are going to practice writing the letter s now we are starting with the uppercase s so this is how it goes. The uppercase S, you will start from, you start from the top line and you carry down to the bottom line. This is the uppercase S. Let's write it again. And it goes like that. So this is the uppercase S. This is the uppercase S. Now, Let's practice writing the lowercase s or trace the lowercase s. And we are going to start from the short dashes or the short lines. So this is how it goes. This is the lowercase s. Let's write another one. And you curve it. Did you get it? If you are unable to do it now, don't worry. Remember, we try and try and we get better. So keep trying and you'll get better. This brings us to the end of today's circle time. But before I say bye-bye, let's sing our special song. And what is our special song? It's the This Old Man rhyming song. And are you ready to sing it along with me? Great! One, two, three. This old man, he play one, he play knick knack on my tongue with a knick knack, but he will give it a gabon. This old man can roll it home two. This old man, he play two, he play knick knack on my shoe with a knick knack, but he will give it a gabon. This old man can roll it home three. This old man, he play three, he play knick knack on my tree with a knick knack, but he will give it a gabon. This old man can Roll it home four. This old man, he play four, he play knick knack on my door with a knick knack, but he will give it a gabon. This old man can roll it home five. This old man, he play five, he play knick knack on my high with a knick knack, but he will give it a gabon. This old man can roll it home. This old man can roll it home. This old man can roll it home. Oh, great singing! Oh, this brings us to the end of today's circle time. And I will see you again. Bye-bye!
Love you.